I answered. Oh, did you? Okay, I missed that. All right, and we can see that Knight is off and running, which I think means Jack needs a little bit of a buffer, so I'm gonna... Oh, man. The buffering is Shit. real. This is not good. Yeah, so... All right, so Jack, I, I can keep you a bit. Uh, well, you obviously need to, to change for the uh, stream, but... Jack got a long sword, he is on 1 2. Finds a shrine of sacrifice. Uh, there's a dragon there, but it's gonna be really hard to maneuver him, so I think he's just gonna kill the dragon. Yeah, that, uh, I can see it now, it's it's up and running, and yeah, he's just gonna wanna make sure to kill the dragon so he does not get dunked. Um, Night Lycon is still on 1 1, he hasn't really found anything, it just was a slow floor. Um, actually, no, he needs a buffer now, too. My goodness, sorry guys. Um, I can tell by the speedrun timer at the bottom. And... Oh! Okay, so Knight takes a little bit of damage because he got monkeyed. Um, he, took, he took a hit from Aeolus Golden. He's oh. still good, but... So he's at half know. a heart now? Half a heart, yeah. Oh yeah, I'm seeing that now. Um, yeah, and we are still getting a bit of buffering and uh, that bothers me to no end, but uh, we'll, just have to, we'll just have to go with it, guys. I'm super sorry about that. And Fubzo, yeah, that's exactly true. The jeweled dagger runs are super fun now. Uh, having that five damage, um, and I feel like I find them only in zone one. I don't know if there's something to that, but if I'm gonna get it, I get it in zone one. Just a lot of fun. And nice lineup by Knight there to uh, kill the dragon right before on the next beat, dropping in the trapdoor. That's pretty awesome. He's off on his zone one boss. Oh, no one managed to the, yeah, two. 2k giant monster kill. That's true. That's true, DJC. Alright, and uh, we're seeing uh, Knight Lycon and Jack are both on the exact same boss. Um, yeah, but Jack got hit, though. Yeah, he did get hit. And um... uh, Knight picking up a better weapon now. Uh, got himself the broadsword. Could have picked up a longsword and had the exact same yeah, weapon so, as Jack, uh... but he decided not to. Yeah, well, for some reason. Oh, and there uh, goes so, all yeah, of Knight's running gold. Through now, this, uh, <laughs> this zone's... Sorry, what's up? Oh, the Leprechaun. Uh, so yeah, running through zone 2 with just a longsword really can be kind of dicey, especially when you're going kind of fast. Obviously, when you want to take it slow and you're trying to kill everything that's behind you, you can do it. But um, you can get in these situations where you just get surrounded by enemies you just cannot kill fast enough. Yeah. And go down. Uh, especially with when you have these golems that are just giant, you know, just take so much damage. Oh, and they take so much um, time that all the enemies get to creep up behind you while you're while you're working on them too. Exactly. So uh, Jack's gonna kill a bat here. There's some golems in his way. Um, I don't know how f if you're behind. To me, he's on two three. He's about uh, to hop into a trap door. Jack? Yeah, no. Jack's yeah. still on two two. Knight is also is now on two three. I mean, the buffering right. is real over here, unfortunately. Um, but that's okay. Right. Um, feel free to. Uh, do your best. Yeah. I mean, it, it can be kind of hard to do sometimes with the different internets. Yeah. Um, uh, Jack Handel is working on a trap door with a nightmare with just that long sword, and he's on Conga. And, it's a Conga trap door. Okay. And I, I see Knight also. Oh, sorry. Were you just talking about Knight? No, I was talking about. I was talking oh, okay. About, uh, Knight Jack. just finished his Condor uh, two two fight as well. So they had the exact same boss order, which is kind of interesting. Um. So, Conga Fight should be finishing up in just a second here. Yeah, we got and Jack just starting the Conga Fight there. Uh, Knight Lycon finishing uh, his Conga Fight and picking up a Titanium Spear. I'm so sorry, Jack. I know that this is kind of confusing. Uh, I'll, I'll, I'll definitely, I'll definitely uh, try to work it. <laughs> and so, Jack picks up an Obsidian Broadsword from his Conga Fight. I don't know if I spoiled that or not. Um, Obsidian bro Broadsword? Yeah, he yeah. just picked it up just now and he's dropping in. Um, yeah, I can kind of tell the differences between the two based on what their timer's at. Um, and so, yeah, Night Lycon's timer's at about 4.05, and Jack down. Uh, what, did he mm -hmm. get clapped there? No, he, he was running away from a clap, and he jumped right into a white, a wraith. Ouch. Uh, or a ghast, or... I think it's a ghast. Uh, zone gas. three. Yep, zone three is ghast. Wraith, white, ghast. Yeah, yeah, that's exactly how it goes. Yeah, and so, uh, Jack's got to sort of try and build up a new build. Right now, I've got Knight buffering, but he's got a Titanium Spear and that uh, Charm, uh, Frost Charm, which is a really nice charm, especially when you only have half a heart. Um, yeah, you can just... And you the buffering on you, both you sides. Use it, you can use it um, intentionally, just get hit on the boss fight or in the trap door, and... and you get the Greater Freeze. And you get, you get the Greater Freeze spell, yeah. It's really good. 
Yeah, and so now uh, he's still wandering around looking. He found himself an obsidian broadsword, decides not to take it. Uh, I guess he killed the boss there. It kind of teleported the thing, and now he's on his boss fight. So this is it here. If he can finish him off, this will be a really fast run. And exactly what you just said, he just Use jumped right charm. into it. Use the freeze charm. I'm assuming he is now complete, like killed him, but it's buffering again. Uh, so yeah, guys, if you want to watch the Cadgar link, feel free to do so. I am super sorry, but I will do the best I can with what I have. Um, okay, so Jack paused there, so I'm assuming that's the end of the race. Yep, and there it is. GG, Knight wins the first one. Congrats to Knight. All right, so we'll give him a score there. Yeah, these two racers, it seems like sort of the perfect storm, these two racers of uh, um, bad buffering issues, but uh, I don't know what to tell you. Yeah, they did both lower their playbacks. Uh, Knight's down at about 1,000. Uh, and Jack's at 1,200, which is what I said, so who knows? All right, so I'm going to give him, let him know we're ready to get started again. World record bard run. What is the world record? 140? Uh, 136 by Petsko Moon. Ah, that's awesome. Well, I have not watched that, actually. I should watch that one. He what actually what's got the a weapon? One he actually, uh, I think it's glass draw, glass longsword, or, um, he did a 138 with a glass cat, and I think he got a glass draw, glass longsword. Oh, that'd be um, awesome to watch. I don't, I don't know if there's a highlight of it. He posted the screenshot on Reddit, uh -huh. and there was a replay, you can watch the replay, but that was the last patch, so. Oh, my so chat if was, I, need, I, need, I need to refresh my chat real quick. That chat's still moving for me, it's just the, the racers aren't. Oh, there we go. Jax jumped into the, into the door there. And Knight is jumping in now, and immediately buffering both of them. That's so weird. I'm going to do a quick speed test here and see if it's my internet just totally dying on me. But I'll try my best. They're both moving again, um, though not much has happened. They're just on 1-1. One, one. Yeah, it looks like my signal to noise is decent. My attenuation is fine. I don't know. Bizarre. Oops, DJC letting me know that Petsko Moo is not a guy, not a he. Uh, very sorry about that. Oh, it is a she. Oh, congrats. Congrats on, <laughs> congrats on not being a guy. Yeah, congrats on not being a guy. Congrats anyways on having a world record. But yeah, we're seeing yeah. Um, some more female uh, Necrodancer players, don't, which don't, is pretty don't, cool. Don't, of course, don't. Mame is, Mame is uh, also really good at this game. Japanese... Uh, the, 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 yeah, um, scary good. One of the best. Uh, it's quickly one of the best. And Jack went down in a trap door? dragon trap door. Yeah. Mm. Oh, see, I'm seeing him still on a minotaur trap door. Oh wow. Yeah, it's bad over here. Alrighty then. Um, but yeah, Jack, I think is still on his first run. Knight is. Oh, there's the tra dragon trap door. So we will see him going down there. Yeah, he got blasted. Uh, it looks like a red bat kind of trolled him. I honestly don't know if it's maybe Twitch or what, but yeah, everything should be running fine according to my uh, to my internet here. Hmm. Like yeah, my, my, uh, I, they're, my they're running they're running completely fine for me. Um, so I don't know exactly what it is, but it's Weird. not like it's it's not like it's a it's a them issue. So. Yeah, that's uh, that's a bummer. All right, I'm gonna run a speed test and see, and then um, I can check with Elas and see if there's anything she's doing. Although typically she's not doing much that's uh, internet heavy. Yeah, it looks like my download's only running at about eight. Should be at fifty. So mm. that's a problem. So so Knight did not flawless his deep blues and was running deep. Uh, was running zone two on a dagger, and the sights hop into a trap door on two two and ended up getting blasted by a dragon. That sucks. Uh, I'm so sorry, guys. I'm just trying to get things organized here. And now I'm having some frame drop issues as well, so hopefully that means it's about to fix itself. Because sometimes that happens. Downloading the new Charles videos. Maybe she's uploading them. <sighs> uh, well, that would be worth it. All worth it, then. <laughs> yeah. Uh, totally. Jack found himself a 1-1 Titanium Rapier from Blood Shop. And Ooh, it's on to 1-2. Oh, okay. 
so yeah. So Knight ended up killing the uh Oh, that's so good. Knight ends up killing the food shop. Grabs the gluttony charm. There's two heart containers and the chicken there, so ends up with five heart containers. Oh man, that's awesome. Yeah, I'm trying to see here what's taking up all the bandwidth and uh Look like it looks like Chrome is, but that makes sense because I'm watching these streams, and I don't think any of my other streams actually are—they're all paused. So everything seems to be making sense. All right, we're gonna close Skype. No way, that's running. Sorry again, everybody. Uh, just trying to get things organized here. Yeah. Um, all right, I'm going to do a quick... It looks like they're... Oh, I have no idea. Um, Jack, you're still there, right? Yeah, I'm here. Uh, so, uh, right now I got Jackaled. He's in 1-3, and he's got himself a titanium uh, rapier. Rapier. Mm -hmm. I have him on a... Yeah, I have him on his boss fight here. Oh, okay. And I just finishing his boss fight, and I have Knight on two two with a titanium spear. Okay. Uh, yeah, that seems uh, he's on two one, um, but he does have the titanium spear. He's got the five health. Uh, yeah, so I mean he's doing pretty well here. That's a, that's a pretty healthy build with the five health. He's got the five bombs and the titanium spear, uh, and I've got Jack finishing off Conga here. Um, with a nice flawless kill. So we'll see what he goes picks up. I imagine he's going to go for the red chest, maybe get himself some health or a uh, pickaxe. Yeah, he's got that pickaxe, so it was a nice quick kill. Um, and he's off with the luminous torch. So that's sweet. Nice pickup. Yeah, if, if Jack pauses, it doesn't sort of kink the hose. It, it actually uh, will just refresh back to the top. So unfortunately, there's really nothing we can do about that uh, issue. Just hopefully it gets better. Um, my internet, I don't know, uh, I, I know I say this every week, but basically I did absolutely everything I possibly can to make my internet as good as it can be, and it's as good as it'll, it'll get, unless I move, because I live in an old building. So yeah, uh, we're also going to close that. There we go. So it was an inter interesting strat from, uh, Knight there, he decides to throw the spear, uh, but did he get the walk of shame? Yeah, I'm seeing him throw the spear now. Uh, oh, and he goes he, to he get goes it. He goes to pick it up. He went to pick it up, and he went to pick it up afterwards. Yeah, and in that situation, you would go straight for the black chest? Uh, or just not throw the spear? I don't know. <laughs> I think it's. I might have done what he did. It, 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 it kind of depends. Uh, you know, I might have thrown it earlier when he was trapped by the zombies and just not pick it up. Oh, and or Jack have had to drop the beat there to line up. Uh, death metal. Death metal, and not uh, yeah. So he didn't get his flawless, That's but it's fine. He's he's got the torch. He's got the weapon. Um, you know, obviously, maybe kind of want to get like a shield spell or a free spell, but yeah. And yeah, that's a really good point, Will. Jack is playing extremely well, and he's completely unknown. I mean, I I know him as a like viewer. I've seen him in my channel and stuff. Um, but he is not known as a racer. Um, so uh, I I mean I'm impressed. He's playing very very well right now, and that's awesome. Because uh, you never really know. It was the same with uh, the first week of Condor, where uh, Mame and Rattata came in, and and they just both played so super well. And a really bad swarm for Jack. Oh my god, that swarm yeah, was he brutal. Yeah, he ends up going down. I uh, got trapped by a bunch of things, and then oh, and then Knight's gonna go in and fight Death Metal with this blast helm. Oh, and that's yeah. a fun. That's a fun situation. That's a fun. That's a fun way to yeah. You get those iframes. You can you can just blast them right next to them. Because sometimes the bombs are hard to line up with death metal because uh, you got to get them kind of to step on it. Yeah, you have to kind of manipulate them. So it can be hard to manipulate them. And if you if you know how to do it, you can maybe kind of force them to to run, jump towards the bomb. Like you you plant it and then you run up. You run towards him and you run like across his body and he'll jump yeah. away from you back onto the bomb. And GG, Knight Lycon winning a second race there. Sorry, guys, again, that the, uh, my internet's being dumb. But, uh, that was, that was really nice. Um, Knight Lycon, of course, playing in proper form, playing very, very well. Um, he tried to throw the expected. spear there, too, on Death Metal, and he didn't line up, so he just went over there and he bombed him again. 
Yeah, that works. All right, and I'm gonna let Will know we're ready to go again. I'm gonna do a quick buffer on, uh, I'm gonna only do one at a time so that we don't actually lose uh, viewing of one of them. But yeah, that was nice. That was a really nice run. Oh, I'm pretty far behind. Uh, I'm sorry, comrade. I don't know what to tell you guys. Okay, so Jack's refreshed. I'm going to now refresh Night Lycon. The beginning of the race isn't typically that interesting, just because they... Oh, and here they go. They both jumped in at the exact same time, so maybe I've got it timed up. Yeah, I have yeah, no idea. yeah. We're, we're, we're... Yay! Like go, internet! <laughs> maybe it's back up and running well. again. Yeah, maybe. Oh, man. All I can do is just... hope. That's all that, that works nowadays. It, uh, I'm not a great bloodshot for... No, that kind of sucks. Golden I mean, you could Spear, try for the transmog. And, yeah. yeah, that was a crappy shot for maybe, sure. Maybe... No, I couldn't even kill the shopkeeper because I didn't have a bomb. That'd really like, nice work of the, the gold there. Uh, using mm -hmm. the gold to kill uh, the dragon faster. Just saving himself a couple of beats. It's, it's important. Yeah, I guess if you wanted to maximize there, if you could have killed the shopkeeper, you could have done that and then transmuted everything, including the blood drum. But didn't have a bomb and it might oh, be just I taking saying, too yeah. long anyway and, and, and for, long anyway. for a total risk right you don't know what the transmog's gonna show you yeah you might you might get no weapons out of that yeah so it looks like my internet is now at 13 and 2 uh, so it's slightly better um, but they are now both buffering at the exact same time um, I don't know okay. Knights on his Knights on his deep blues fight uh... Yeah, I have and Knight it, uh, about to drop down that trapdoor, uh, getting his deep blues, and Jack is on one two um, with that gold uh, gold spear. I think it's like, you know, it's just been a bit of a slow floor for him. He's having to sort of take it slow, not dropping down a lot of trapdoors. Knight kind of goes off the rails here with his uh, deep blues fight, and now what's yeah, his plan? He tried to get the bomb there, and it didn't work because the king just ran away from him. Yeah, the so, king moved, um, although he managed to bomb some of the queens, which is nice. And now he can just line them all up. So that he did just fine. Uh, he still used a bomb. It just took a little longer, but he is ahead. So And Jack finding the boots of strength. Such a good item. Yeah, it's, yeah, it's very nice. Um, you can even keep that... Oh, you can even keep that gold spear for the entire run because you have the two damage and the possibility of the infinite damage. Yeah, that's, although, that's not bad. Um, Knight picks up an obsidian handle. rapier, so that, I mean, that, when it comes to the difference between the two weapons, obsidian rapier is quite a bit better, so I don't know if uh, Jack is watching the other stream. Oh, and down Whoa. he goes there, gets bit by, I think it was a pawn? It was a knight. A he, knight. Tried, oh, he tried to bugger. backstep from a, from a pawn or a queen, and the knight was just waiting for him, so off he goes. and. Uh, Knight is making quick work of this. Yeah, run. Knight is is. It looks like he's warmed up now because he's he's just moving now, going very very fast. He's already heading down to his own two boss. Really good, having to bomb to get metal. by that setup. Yeah, he's on to death metal. Really nice. He's got his full charge up, so all he needs to do now is just line him up and do six damage. Really good, and there it is, taking him down. And so yeah, he's gonna look for a torch. He finds the holy water. Oh, so at this fine, point, but you really just want a torch, but yeah, he can just take a sweet time. He needs now. to take a sweet time because uh, now the pressure is a hundred percent on Jack. Of course, Jack is already down two and zero in this in this race, so it's up to Knight. Uh, sorry, it's up to Jack to to push it, and Knight is just gonna, you know, I would slow right down, make sure I get a really strong build. Uh, I Check get on a little. Check my shops. Look for oh, some yeah. armor. Some Absolutely. Parts. Yeah, at this point, you know, unless you want to go for a world record. But you already passed it, so really it's just, uh, yeah, yeah. Take your time. Get like, like he just spawned in front of a shop there on three two, so he should just go look in there. We'll see if he does. And he does, and finds some food. He I finds guess the food, then he realizes that the holy water is better anyway. Oh no! Yeah, that's true. <laughs> that's funny. And does he use the trapdoor? He doesn't, and I think that's a good call. And down goes Jack again. Looks like he just miscalculated or mis mistimed that Minotaur kill. Uh, and that, putting down his holy water again, picking it back up. His night like on. Finding a find map. Himself. 
There's a freeze, the freeze scroll in that chest, which he's gonna take Might over well the holy it. water. I used to take it over the oh, holy water. Oh, he's taking it. Yeah, yeah. I don't mind that. Me neither. The free scroll is definitely really good. He Super already fought good, death especially metal, in your so boss, yeah. He's got Kanga last, but it's kind of hard to use it on Kanga. Um, yeah, that's true. Bomb. Yeah, you gotta kind of get him off his. And I assume you can't freeze him if you miss a beat. Is that true? And do damage. No, to him? you can't. Not you don't have the phasing weapon, so no. Uh. He's gonna take this <laughs> nice and slow. Let's yep. just kill everything. Yeah, take your time. I like how he threw that uh, skeleton into the the teleporter, and then he teleported yeah, like teleported two right, steps two behind. Yeah, two spaces behind. Yeah. Pretty funny. Oh. Careful. Now he handles it. Nice. Yeah, he is doing a very good job of just cleanly killing this 3-3 three, three floor. Of course, 3-3, three, three, I find it just... I'm always a little on edge with that 3-3. Three, three. Oh, taking a, sh taking a shot there from the uh, the slime. Easy to do. Had the apple. Yeah, had the apple, so puts himself back up to a heart and a half, and he's on to his boss fight, which is deep blues. Nope, Conga. Conga. I'd actually freeze right away. Get rid of those coals. Yeah, Kanga's Kanga, Kanga, Kanga the... real tricky. Kanga's real tricky sometimes. And I don't love the way he's got this set up here. A little too close to that Clappa. Handles it nicely, though. No, he doesn't! Oh my goodness, Knight! He, 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 needed he didn't to have freeze. enough damage. He needed to freeze. Wow! Uh, yeah, so that sometimes hurts. it lines up. Sometimes it lines up perfectly, so where you just go straight up the middle and you'll 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 lunge at him and it's fine. But he needed to freeze there and and get the two hits. Yeah, yeah. and he he did three damage to Kanga, and t Kanga has four health. So I, but I'm ouch. I'm definitely I'm definitely with Fubzo. Should I'm definitely with you. Should have frozen yeah. right away. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Kill just you can go up the lines even. Just go yeah, up just the lines. drive through the lines. Just use lawnmower strats and just right up there. And then <laughs> I mean, <laughs> you can just totally you can totally do that. You can totally uh. Take out those goblins and the dog and the yeti and deal with the zombies later if you need to. It's just like yeah, yeah. Oh, absolutely. Kaga, I just, you have so Kaga many beats the worst. with things frozen. I, I feel like I'm just going to come always just die on Conga Three if I can't bomb them, even if I can't bomb them. Yeah, Conga Three is the hardest boss fight in my opinion. It's just always has, so much always going has on. Been. Yep, always has been. There's just so many things happening. Those goblins will sneak up on you if you have things lined up incorrectly. The clap is going to be there once you're done with the conga lines. You've got that dog, and of course dogs move really fast. Just bad. And there's a red bat too, right? Yeah. Uh, yeah, Jack's got a glass spear. Yeah, that yeah red Jack is, really... is doing well here. And of course, um, now it's his race to lose. Uh, he's doing yeah. really, really well. Um, of course, it was Knight's race to lose yeah. not too long ago. And he's got the same weapon. Knight keeps trying to go a little fast. Yeah, and that might be his just it might just be an inability to oh and down he goes from the dark minotaur. Um that mm -hmm. might just be an inability to go slow. Um one thing we did talk about while you were racing, I think uh two weeks ago, is how much is it a factor that people who speedrun a ton just can't take their foot off the pedal or off the gas and just go too fast for the for uh, themselves. I, I definitely tried um whenever I was racing um Momo to just slow it down. I died the one time because of a, a a weird thing where I misread Deep Blues. I'm just like, okay, I just need to take all the time in the world. It's okay. Just, you know, when you're racing someone uh, who is kind of, you know, not the super as fast, you know, you're not racing Rat, you're not racing me, it's okay. You can go a little, a little more slowly and make sure you don't die here. Yeah, that's true. Uh, Although at this situation, I mean, Jack is... Clearly playing yeah. very, very well. Now, uh, I'm assuming... Well, I don't know. Would you take the glass dagger or the jewel dagger in that situation at all? Uh, does it depend on your uh, final boss? Like, if you if have a, if you have a deep, final if boss... If I have last, I'm going to take... Yeah, me too. Yeah, I think it depends on your boss. Uh, and really, it, it just depends depend, if it's deep or, blues uh, or not. I, or deep blues. The dagger to run it all yeah, the way? Yeah, death battle, you two shot him. That's actually... But sometimes getting past those uh, beetles can be kind of tricky to get an early hit on death metal. And we got the flail or fail flail over on uh, Knight's side, so he's gonna be rushing back nice and quick. That is a fast And he's got an eight 
It's an eight damage eight flail. Eight damage flail, he yeah. Has the so he's gonna one shot everything but death metal. Yeah, that is awesome. Has the map, so I mean, he can, he can. Yeah, this can Jack... be a sub four run. It's just not gonna be fast enough. If Jack yeah, that's true. Yeah, Jack's. I mean, Jack's on three three already. So all he needs to do is just finish it up. He's got those lead boots, so he can walk on the ice with no no problems. I didn't see him miss any beats either, uh, which is what I always look out for when people pick up lead boots to see if they miss beats on the. Uh, just by standing still on the ice, um, but they didn't. Of course, uh, I'm sure you guys are all aware, but the ice mechanics is that. Oh, and down goes Knight. Looks like he got. I'm not hit sure by what happened skeleton. there. I'm really uh, not sure I'm what not happened I'm not sure if there. he's sure either. He seems to be watching the. Because oh, it seems like he killed the 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 mage. Yeah. And then the the skeleton just hit him immediately afterwards. That was so. weird. It seems like he should have been fine. Maybe someone in chat will see it and will know exactly what yeah, happened. Yeah, well, he showed it again. Or maybe we'll just yell at Ryan. Yeah, I think yeah, that's, that's a sense. Ryan kill. It didn't make any more sense the second time, and Jack just finished. He did have Deep Blue's last. He does finish. Oh, so we could have um, got the Jeweled Dagger. Yeah. But I think I think uh, Knight probably was not... It's not going to matter in the long run, but Knight's going to be pretty mad about that one. Yeah, seriously. All right, and I'll stop it there. It, it just uh, finished for me. Um, just writing some notes real quick. All righty. Uh, cool, so that's uh, Jack coming back. Even though he was uh, down 2-0, that's that's a tough win to win. When you're pushed up against the wall like that, it can be it can be very difficult sometimes to come back and, and have the presence of mind to, to come back. So, um, yeah, awesome. Good job for him. All right, so I'm just letting Will know we're ready to go. We'll get on to... Round four, uh, and we'll see if uh, Jack can tie it up or if Knight's gonna take this one and head on to the semifinals. Of course, playing the winner of Bloodshot versus Comrade Nugget. Uh, I'm really excited to see how that goes. I don't know uh, if you're aware, Jack, uh, but the um, Comrade and Comrade and Bloodshot are neck and neck in the leaderboards, and they're separated by like three seconds on their PVs. Oh, really? I know. Yeah. I'm really. I'm actually really, uh, I've never seen Bloodshot, and I'm really impressed because he's always on the Necrodancer forums. He does one of the, he's has one of the, he's one of the uh, people with the Aria Low Percent uh, accomplishment too, and just generally really smart um, people. Uh, I also do have to agree with what chat saying. Jack has been really impressive to me so far too. Absolutely. Um, down 2 0, but there's well. really no shame um, in being down 2 0 to Knight Lakon. Yeah, Knight is, uh, as you were saying, one of the best players in the world, so it <laughs> can't be too uh, can't be too sad about his performance. Uh, he's playing really well. Obviously, took one off Knight, which uh, I think even that alone is, is hard to do. It did it did require Knight to die. Um, Knight was about to win, and of course, died on, on Kanga, but that's certainly nothing to be ashamed about um, for, for Jack still winning, still pulling it out. Uh, so good on him, and maybe that'll give him a little bit of confidence and let him uh, win another race and see if he can take this to game five. Oh my god, Jack finds a Shrine of Peace, and his Blood Shop has an Embarrassment of Riches, a Glass Flail, and a Glass Longsword. He jumps back and forth a little bit, decides to take the Longsword. I would oh, take wow. the Flail, but I have a soft spot for that. Oh wow, that is wild. Yeah, I just I saw that now. Flail. That is. I would have taken the longsword, um, but I've had some bad experiences with the glass flail, and and you know how that goes. Everyone has their own. Um, actually, someone was talking about that earlier in chat. You know, what's your favorite weapon and that sort of thing. And one thing I absolutely love about this game is that there's no. I mean, everyone has their favorites, and there's no obviously best weapon. Oh, Jack down. Stepped on a bounce. Yeah, back? he just stepped on a spike trap. It looked. It looked like he was trying to maybe dodge an enemy or. He thought he was going to hit an enemy, but didn't, and he just jumped on a spike trap. Dope. Spike trap deaths are not ones you want to be doing. Those tend to be uh, an example of nerves, usually. Because that really shouldn't happen. Those things don't move very fast. Spike traps. But sometimes you can get chased onto one by an enemy, so I don't want to give him a hard time or anything. Yeah, I, I do that a lot where um, an enemy jumps on a spike trap. And I try to hit the enemy as he jumps into the spike trap, and so I jump into the spike trap myself. I was told by Zelnus I need to uh, refresh Jack, so I am currently doing that. Uh, um, he's got a blood whip and a ring of war, and he just cleared out the. Uh, the yeah, he's on death metal the, right now. Yeah, yeah I think so I, yeah, I caught right back up. Yeah, so yeah he's, he's making quick work of this run. So oh, what far. a nice fight! Really, really I know, clean that's with a whip. Super impressive. Mm, I that wish was really nice. 
He's gonna check his black chest, and I he think... gets an obsidian. Right oh here. wow! Okay, he's got to move. He's still two floors behind. Finds himself, I think, a potion room. I'd take it. Yeah, especially with the Ring of War. Even if um, it's your last bomb, I'd still take it. And he's no, not he gonna. No, he decides not to. Uh, let's hope oh, he doesn't man, regret that decision. You got the Ring of War, man. Just fucking, just run right. Yeah, up just mash the mash the minotaur. Seriously. Man. Uh, <laughs> that's that's probably just sometimes you know when you're busy thinking about other things, you're not gonna realize. Oh, and now he's got oh, that he's bomb. Rock blocked. Yes. Rock blocked. Use yeah. your bomb now. Oh, you use definitely have to use it. You have to use your bomb <laughs> Jack, here. Please. Uh, oh, he's, he will use it. Okay, he will he use does it. use it. Yeah. Okay. Good. And Night Lycon yeah, is moving combo. into his zone three after uh, he's currently fighting. This is such a weird looking build. He's got the heavy plate and the uh, blood, uh, the blood flail. Well, that's good because you can use you can use heavy plate to take the damage if you want to, or you can just use it to try and the flail by itself, base one base damage is okay. And I would probably just keep the blood flail over the titanium spear. Um, you can go just fast with a one damage flail, and with that you know with the combination of the 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 plate and the uh, the blood weapon means you're not going to die. But he decides to take the titanium spear anyway. He does take the titanium spear. I'm going to do a quick refresh on that. Yeah, the the rapier ring of war is the original wombo combo. Fubzo uh, finds himself a charm of protection. This Jack uh, from his uh, boss. He's on a three one. Going the wrong way here. That's the shop. That's not the way you want to go. Yeah, so this is this is gonna be really tight. Uh, it's still Knight with the lead here, but uh, I think a yeah, faster he, build over on Jack's Jack. side. Yeah, he's going all the wrong ways though. Now he's got to deal with goblins, and that can always take forever. Yeah, that so sucks. He and he's already at half. He's at half right now. And I think that that charm actually saved him, or he would have died. Oh, and then he just oh, reads the goblin I just and he saw jumps that. right into it. Shoot! Oh my goodness. That's not so good. Right. So that looks like it's uh, set up for Knight to take this. He's got that. Now, do you use the risk charm? No, no, no. I would not. I would no. not. I mean. If, if it, you have the heavy plate, so if it comes down to it, you can yeah, maybe just, it. like, yeah. use it if it happens. Yeah. But the fact that you're ahead, and he might not know that he's, like, super ahead at this point. Yeah, he so might it, not have seen the death depends. yet. It kind of depends. If, if he knows he's right behind, then maybe you do take the, uh... Yeah. You take it just to get that four damage, but, um, Looks like he's not gonna... He's not, uh, yeah. actively trying to take any damage. If you get stomped on a dragon with the heavy plate, how much damage do you take? A full heart or half a heart? He would take a full heart because the the dragon stomp is uh, three full hearts of damage, and you 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 get to protect two full hearts from the heavy plate. Right. Oh, it was getting oh oh. Okay. Yeah, that was He's a bit of a scary spot there, but he handled it He's, very nicely. He handled it. Handled it. Glass yeah, that torch. titanium titanium zone three is always a little bit weird. And, uh, and he's off on to um, death metal fight here. Yeah, he take the super slow. Just, oh, just, just... sketchy. Yeah, yeah just, kill, just kill beats. I just kill there. beats on this fight. I just kill beats on this fight. Yeah, yeah. He's gonna exactly. use bomb strats. That's nice fine. You don't have to, to do the bomb that. And throws it for the oh. swaggy kill. Very nice. And a six minute, just under six.